Hey what's up guys welcome back to another exciting episode of iGeeks blog this is Puneet Khatri back with another video so basically guys it often happens that I take prefer taking screenshots or like if I am writing something if I want to store something I take screenshot for any subst substantial instances so by default what happens is that the standard format or the default format of screenshots on Mac OS is PNG but I prefer JPG over that because that's universally accepted and you can use it at much more places as compared to PNG so what all I did is that I changed the format of screenshot by default from PNG to JPG so the good thing is that on Mac OS the change in the format of screenshots is damn easy and straightforward. So guys without wasting any bit of time let's get started and see how can you just go ahead and change the default format of screenshots on your Mac OS. So the very first thing you need to do is head over terminal. So just uh, search in the spotlight search for terminal. Okay, and once you're in the terminal what you need to do is that down in the description box there would be a command. Just copy that command and paste over here. So this is the basic command and then you need to tap a space. You know, like you need to put in a space bar or like you need to put a space. And now you need to write which format you want your de default screenshots to be. By default, it's PNG. If you want it to be JPG, just type JPG. If you want it to be PDF, type PDF. If you want it to be TIFF, like that's T-I-F-F, just type that. If you want it to be a GIF, type GIF. So by default, whatever you want, you can just go ahead and enter that particular format over here and hit the return key. So I just want to keep it as a JPG. So I'll just keep it a JPG and hit the return key. And that's all. The command has been saved. So what I'll do is just I'll take a screenshot. Okay. And here I'll go and over more get info. And here you can see the kind is JPG now. So you you I saw that it's quite easy. I'll show you once again with PDF. So I'll put it PDF at the return key. Now again I'll take a screenshot. Now by default it's taking a PDF as a screenshot. You can see that. Now if you want to change it back to suppose PNG, so again use the same command and enter PNG and hit the return key, and that's all you're done. You're ready to go. So again, I'll get, get info and here you guys can see it's like PNG, that's portable network graphic image, PNG image. So that's how you can just go ahead and change the format or the default screenshot on your Mac OS, whichever is most preferable to you. Also guys, to ensure that your desktop doesn't get full or like it doesn't get messed up with lots of screenshots being taken place you can also change the location of the screenshots being taken or like where the screenshots are being stored so for instance I'll go into finder uh, I want to keep it in pictures and I have created a folder over here that is screenshots and I want these screenshots all whatever I take to go over here so there again there is a command down below so just copy the command from the description paste it over here so this pictures and then forward slash screenshots is the folder that I have created I want to keep it under pictures and under screenshots whatever location you have created your folder and you can just put up that location over here and then hit the return key and that's all guys the default location has been changed so that's about it guys I hope you enjoyed this video this was a quick video which would help you to change the default format of the screenshots being taken on your Mac OS as well as to change the location where the screenshots are being saved. So that's about it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you then feel free to give a thumbs up to this video. Also make sure to subscribe to iGeeks blog. Uh, the subscribe button would be down right there on the left corner. And if you have some questions, if you want to ask us something, comment down below. And also let me know from the comment section down below. What do you guys think about this process? Like how helpful was this to you? And I'll get back to you guys later in my next video. Peace out.